Hey, what's up everyone? Hitbo TC here. And if you have been following the mystery at all over the last couple of months, we have all been on the hunt for who killed DeMarco. Well, we are finally at the conclusion of this mystery and we know who did it. First and foremost, it wasn't me. Secondly, this video is gonna show you how to learn it for yourself and I will have a little spot in here to make sure that if you don't want any spoilers to turn the video off but there are a couple places that you need to go to activate some things and do some things and such and stuff so I'm going to show you how to do all of that I'm also going to include the footage of the big reveal so if you just want to watch this video through its entirety feel free to do that or just skip right there in the video as well I will mark it now with all that being said let's jump into the guide video so to do this mystery conclusion, you have to sail to five islands, Smuggler's Bay, Wanderer's Refuge. You have to go to Old Faithful, Kraken's Fall, and Ashen Reaches. At each of these islands, you have to play the Ballard of the Merfolk at a certain location, and it will activate a symbol, a symbol that is on a door in one of the shrines, the Shrine of the Coral Tomb. So I'm gonna show you the location of each of these spots. We found it on stream, so I'm gonna show you the location and then we will jump uh, to the next part that you gotta do. But basically you gotta go to each of these islands, play the song, activate the symbol, and once you've done all five, you're going to go back to the Shrine of the Coral Tomb. Now the first symbol is gonna be on the northwestern side of Smuggler's Bay. Uh, you can kind of see me struggling right here, but there you go. You play it near this rock and it will activate the first symbol. The next symbol, we are going to jump on over to Old Faithful. Near the center of it, you're going to see this, uh, you know, this gate and this wooden structure. You're going to look for this pointy rock right here. Play the song in front of it and it will, you know, activate the symbol. So again, this is Old Faithful. It does take a little bit to start it, so make sure to play that song until you hear um, that certain noise that kind of lets you know that it, it's done. And it'll also disappear. Next, we have Wander's Refuge. Sorry for the uh, the bad quality. We had some issues with Death Knight's OBS, so it kind of failed a little bit, but it's near the center of the island, and you can kind of see it right there. So I'm going to let this, play, uh, this clip play a little bit so you can kind of get the idea of where it was at. But uh, hopefully that helps. Next, we have Kraken's Fall. You can find that near the center of the island, kind of on the eastern side of the island. Make sure to stand a little bit closer to the rock and play that song, and it should activate that symbol. And last but not least, we have Ashen Reaches. This is going to be on the kind of the western side of Ashen Reaches. Make sure to look for the wreckage right here. And you're going to play the Ballad of the, the Mermaids right in front of uh, this, this kind of area. You do have, it's kind of more difficult because of the geysers, but just play it, get it activated, and you are good to go. Now, once you have activated all of the five symbols on each of those islands, you're going to head back to the Coral Tomb, and you are going to have to do the three sequences to raise the water. Once you do that, it's going to access or give you access to this tunnel, which is going to lead to the door, which is where all those symbols are that you activated to kind of light them up so that the door would open. So here's what it looks like. Now there's one more bit that I'm going to share because there is a sequence of levers that you're gonna have to pull just in case uh, so you don't drown. So make sure to have this code ready. The sequence that you need to pull the levers in is blue, pink, orange, and yellow. 
that's very important so you don't drown so make sure to make note of that and this is the part where i'm going to say if you don't want spoilers jump out of the video i'm going to let this play and you guys can get the full effect without my commentary i hope you enjoy it the mystery of who killed demarco Another land dweller sees through my illusion and wishes to avenge the death of the sea dog. No matter, I have entombed his sister, and soon I shall do the same to you. here as my song spreads across the waves, enthralling your kind to blindly follow my riddles as pirates always do. Your minds are so easy to bend to my will. Soon all shall come to believe that their noble pirate lord is the ruthless killer of his own son. He shall be cast out 
And the world above shall descend into chaos! Pirates will no longer pose a threat to my dominion. Enough! You killed my son, took my daughter, and why? All because you wished pirates to witness the wrath of the merciless pirate lord. Your majesty, your wish is my command. No! Dad, you're here. How did you know? The Sea of Thieves faces so many dangers. That is why I came here once before, to seek peace with the Sirens. I asked Demarco to be my envoy, a bridge between the two worlds, but he refused. Chose to depart rather than watch his father make such a foolish mistake. When I let slip that Demarco was leaving, the Siren Queen saw her chance to discredit me. The logbook. The mutiny. Even if I had spoken out, few would have believed me. The Queen is gone now. People will come to their senses. They'll understand. Perhaps. But that won't bring DeMarco back to us. For that I have only myself to blame. We mustn't lose hope. DeMarco's soul may still be out there somewhere. I won't rest until I know for sure. That's my girl. Now, it's time for us to leave. I've got a lot of explaining to do. Hit bow? I think that was worth it, don't you think? <laughs> That was pretty awesome right there, chat. That was, that was pretty freaking awesome. I think that was so worth it. Okay, everything I take and said about the mystery, I almost take back. They should have still not time locked it like they did, but that was nuts. Yeah, we've unlocked a new accommodation page in the Pyrus log. What? Mysteries play your part in unearthing some of the most well buried secrets the Sea of Thieves have to offer. The fallen Sea Dog. You've uncovered the truth and learned the tragic fate of the Sea Dog, DeMarco. Under what, so, sir? The moment we. the mo In reputation, it's in reputation. So, Reputations. Pyrus log, reputation. Pyrus log, reputation. Bilge rats. What did we get for it? A tattoo? No, I don't know. We just get we just got this. We so just maybe we'll get something. We just got accommodation? <laughs> accommodation and doubloons. But we unlocked a new page. I find that to be fun. That was cool. Oh, I need a black screen there. Do not walk there. That, <laughs> that was, was uh, really cool. We got ten doubloons. Let's go. Hey, that was neat though. I like that. That was uh...